What's good, YouTube? It's your boy R. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. Hope you guys are doing good. So we're gonna be reacting to Uncle Roger. Stop making food in coffee maker. What? I don't understand if he's if he's starting. Like, well, obviously, stop making coffee. I mean, stop making food in coffee. Coffee maker. Anyhow, if you guys are new to the channel, man, especially about to subscribe, comment down below. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. Show your boys some love. Let's get to it. Come on. Uncle Roger, help us out. Uncle Roger, the induction stove is the worst thing you can cook on, but some people out there are animal and they cook food in coffee maker. I made a boiler in a coffee maker in a hotel room. Okay. If you're traveling and you can't afford food, maybe the solution is not coffee maker. Maybe solution is don't travel. No, I'm not. It's a hustle. You. It's Uncle Roger. That part. Hotel is terrible place. If you've been to hotel, Uncle Roger guarantee they don't wash the coffee maker at all. And now in this video, this niece here, she making a whole meal in coffee maker. Hi, yeah. It like she want to get diarrhea on purpose. Everybody <laughs> is disgusting in hotel hey. because <laughs> that remind me right. I got a piece of barracuda in the fridge. I haven't gonna lie to y'all. That damn fried fish be in the uh, uh, fridge for a, minute, for a minute. I think I told my daddy or somebody told him about the fish. So it was like, like you trying to dead on purpose. So I was like, because I said I was going to eat it. Like, you trying to dead on purpose. I said, why is it like a damn over rubbery fish? Go ahead, go ahead, go eat it, go eat it. They made me scared, so I threw it away. <laughs> Our house, we don't give shit. We treat hotel room like how how to basic treat his house. Remember, oh, this is just bastard. comedy we joke. Uncle Roger, just joking around. Don't go attack anyone after this. Just laugh. I made a boiled egg in a coffee maker in a hotel room. Ordering room service at hotels can get pretty expensive, and when you travel often, sometimes you just crave home cooked food. So, what? This is your home cooked oh. food. No, 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 no. I didn't mean cook food. From your mother making food in coffee. A boiler. You need to get new mother. I think this girl mom is psycho. First, here are some items that are easy to carry in your luggage. Instant oatmeal packets, instant ramen. You know what easier to carry than all those things? Cash. You can use this to buy food instead of making it in coffee maker. Flour tortillas. Small paper plates, aluminum foil sheets, and plastic cups. This damn cheap. All these items fit perfectly into one food storage bag. And she nicely, cheap. That look like most depressing holiday ever. <laughs> also, imagine if you get stuck at custom carrying that pack of shit. <sighs> uh, Uncle Roger rather get stuck for carrying white powder. And by white powder, I mean MSG. Once you arrive at your destination, you can pick up a local convenience store and pick up small items like half dozen eggs, some bacon, and a... Wait, what? Once you arrive at your destination, you can hit up a local convenience store or grocery. So you're gonna go to store anyway? So why do you just get food from store? Why bother packing that sad food in bag? What a logic, hi yeah. Oatmeal. Place instant oatmeal in a coffee maker carafe. Fill the reservoir with filtered water and turn it on. Looks so sad. Let's sit for a bit. Pro tip, if your room offers complimentary tea bags, just add it to your oatmeal for some extra flavor. Whoa! Ew. Add tea bag to oatmeal? Why do oh, you want the oat to taste like tea? Earl Grey tea? Oatmeal is the saddest food ever. It's so sad, even MSG cannot save it. It like white people congee. Congee is one of Uncle Roger's favorite dish ever. It's a classic Chinese breakfast dish or something you Uncle Roger, this is what you say. Right in Asia. Hey, Uncle Roger, stop trying to disrespect oatmeal, eh? I like oatmeal, stop playing with that, bro. No one disrespect oatmeal while I sit in here, buddy. I, I, boy, don't play me like that, eh? You say, oh, you that's my gangsta! Nobody need doctor. Mom, I have COVID. Just eat congee. <laughs> Offers complimentary tea bags. Just add it to your oatmeal for some extra flavor. Yes, for tea bagging. Tea bagging. For tea bagging. So dirty, Disney's. But being tea bagged by someone still more hygienic than using hotel coffee maker. Sorry, children. 
Hey, look at that. I also love a little so set on top. Gently place eggs in the carafe, add filtered water. I guess Turn on the boiling egg, okay. Allow the eggs to sit for about seven to 10 minutes, peel and enjoy. Yeah, like I said, boiled okay. eggs, okay. Place the packet contents into the carafe, add, you guessed it, filtered water, turn it on. So she making instant noodle now. Who packed oatmeal with instant noodle? What is... <clears throat> I don't know what to say, poverty. The carafe. Make sure you clean the carafe really well with some soap and water afterwards. Here's what you can make with an iron. So what? she's gonna destroy the coffee maker, now she's gonna destroy the iron. Hiya. Form an iron sheet pan by folding. Who travel with aluminum foil? Un Who packing for trip going okay? I pack shoe, I pack jean, I pack my underwear. Feel like I'm missing something. Oh yeah, my I know. Room. Travel essential. Allow the iron to heat up and you can cook items like bacon. You use some of that bacon fat to fry an egg. You just need a little bit of patience. Wait, so you have to hold in the iron this whole time? How much free time this woman has? Are you unemployed or something? <laughs> oh. Can make a quickie quesadilla on an iron board. No, no, no. Then tortilla, spread on the cheese. I think she's just cheap. She does have a cheap, that's all it is. First of all, iron not replacement for real fire. You want to cook, use the real fire. You want to walk hay, no such thing as iron hay. Also, when business people, they actually want to use iron. To iron cook shirt, but and now they smell like bacon and tortilla. Exactly. You're gonna get them fired. Feeling fancy? Use a coffee maker to make actual coffee this time. You get a small container of ice cream and make yourself an avocado dessert. It may not be in a sweet, but I'm sure living the sweet life. That's fat. <laughs> I think she just her belly long. That's a problem. All she thinking about is her gut. Gosh, man. And that's the nastiest thing. They should throw every damn thing in her mouth. <laughs> Making us fat people look bad. The exact moment she regret her decision. She trying hard to pretend that it tastes good, but Uncle Roger back after the camera stopped rolling. She just go pleh, pleh, pleh. Secretly, she just died inside. But it not only her. See, this another video. Can this chef make three course meal in coffee maker? Hiya. Why you all torturing uh. Uncle Roger like that? Why? I'm Alexa, I'm senior food specialist here at Tasty. Oh. No. You can leave it. No, don't take her rice cooker. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you can leave it. I don't drink coffee, and I think I'm... You don't drink coffee? So how you wake up? Is it just the voices in your head? It feels hot, so I think I can actually go ahead and add the shrimp. So we just want to make sure that the shrimp is cooked through and pink. You, it's actually turning pink. You can see it turning pink. It turning pink because it embarrassed to be seen with you. If Uncle Roger hang out with woman who put seafood in coffee maker, I turn pink also. Auntie Helen has new boyfriend now, and I hope her new boyfriend only make food for her in coffee maker. Because <laughs> that's all she deserves. I'm allowed to say, like, give myself a pat on the back, but this is really good. Salmon. She gonna make salmon in coffee maker. Next, I'm going to poach the salmon. Oil you like your belly. Need enough oil to submerge the salmon. Ah, she making salmon confit. Salmon down so that it'll actually fit in the coffee pot. I'm gonna infuse the oil with some peppercorns, lemon rinds. Okay, dill. decent ingredient. I'm getting the oil to about 180. I'm gonna yeah. add the salmon in. So, oh. <laughs> This looks really gross. The fat is clearly leaving the salmon. Ew! Mm. You're right, it grows the fat leaving salmon. And you should leave kitchen. Hiya. Salmon is beautiful fish and you treat it like this. It looks like the salmon mutating. It trying to grow leg so it can escape from there. The fat is clearly leaving the salmon. Also, niece and nephew, this not fat, this a protein in salmon called albumin. 
And when you cook salmon too hot, it all come up like this. It made Uncle Roger put my leg down from chair. I think because in this coffee maker, you can't control temperature. The heating at bottom, so bottom part hotter than top part. Uncle Roger don't know why she used thermometer to measure temperature. You can't even control that shit. And then, but it looks like, oh my god. It looks like it's covered in warts. There's like little balls of fat. A little dance when she see close thing. Oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, salmon. Uh, I don't know. Look just like Auntie Helen before makeup. This needs a thorough wash after what just happened. Yeah, no shit. On to part two. So for this, I'm gonna like simmer. Why are you leaving up the way to try and do shit like this? Pot feels wrong. What? What she say? What, what she say? I'm just putting beans in a coffee pot feels wrong. Putting bean in coffee pot feel wrong, but putting prawn and salmon in there feel right. What? You, what this woman thinking? Uncle Roger would hate to be her roommate. Good morning. Time for my coffee. <laughs> Why coffee tastes like fish? Did you make salmon again, Haya? So hopefully those no. tomatoes can blacken and kind of run for your life. To I hate people. tomatoes. They're gonna torture you. Uh, hopefully they can get some char. Ooh. Okay, there's some sound. Just like Jamie Oliver Weecher. You hear sizzling, I hear your ancestor crying. <gasps> there's a little bit of, a little bit Just of. Just that not enough color. Ugh, you might as well eat it raw if look like this. I'm done, so I'm gonna ask my friend. You can try it and you're gonna text your friend. Don't invite oh. other people to eat this bullshit. If your friend invite you to their place to eat coffee maker food, they are not your friend. I feel like they're gonna have. You need, you need, need to re retake your circle. Re rethink your circle, I man. Guess a coffee maker. I of course. Okay, her voice is most annoying voice Uncle Roger ever here. I changed my mind. <laughs> you deserve to eat coffee with the food. One and die. One and die, honey. One and die, honey. One and die, honey. That's all Uncle Roger here. One and die. We've got some white beans with with olive oil poached salmon, steamed asparagus ribbons, and blistered tomatoes. You like you like it? Hiya, where your taste bud? Where your taste bud? This challenge today. And to make all these three courses. You know what pissed me, really pissed me off about this whole thing? That damn woman ain't seasoned that freaking salmon at all. She just put that damn salmon in that coffee pot and turned her back. Um, lemon and lime is not seasoned, that's herbs. But you think I didn't see her? She, she almost tricked me though, she almost tricked me. Oh God. I made all three courses using only a coffee maker. Stop! A three, stop making food in coffee maker. Hi. I hope her new boyfriend always cook for her. I hope Auntie had a new boyfriend always cook food for her in coffee maker. That's all she deserves. <laughs> all right, let's try. Coffee spitting scene, let's try to not ruin any of my <laughs> laptop. That's so I got it. <laughs> if they invite you over for coffee maker food, they not friend. Friend, don't try to give friend diarrhea. Uh, nieces and nephews, feel free to Photoshop this still. Um, it can be an Uncle Roger meme, you know, right? Just put text on it. And by white powder, I mean MSG. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you, Uncle Roger. <laughs> but, yeah, bro. She think I see. What feels the same due to recording? God damn it. No, look how you some of these people. Hey, alright, cool. Keep playing with me. I can slap the shit out of you. No, this is what I was saying. Um. Damn. Ah! She is, she's an African fish. She think I see her, but that's okay. Don't worry, Susan. I catch you. You don't see it. You don't have to put damn salt on top of the minimums, bro. Nasty, bro. 
But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Man, if you guys are new to the channel, man, drop a like, comment down below, all that good stuff. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. Just a young fat boy trying to do something productive. But with that being said, I hope you guys have an awesome day. Be happy, be blessed, and remember, through all this, yours. Peace. I'm out.